that he just basically drives through the Midwest in this documentary, and it's the same guys who did um, Heavy Metal Parking Lot. They, like, follow along with them, and we just go with Ernest Borgnine. He goes to, like, the shoe factory of the shoe place he likes, and they go to, like, the Miller High Life Brewery, and it's just Ernest Borgnine being, like, salt of the earth old guy talking to people, being like, last time I was here. And it's fucking amazing. It's the best hour of your life. Nick, do you remember the last time you watched Heavy Metal Parking Lot? Yeah, I watch it every night before bed. Wait, I'm sorry. Do, have you guys ever seen that? No. Why would we have seen that, Joe? So Stop every... getting surprised when we don't <laughs> see these things. What okay, did you look. bring up? You brought up something earlier, too. I forget what Joe, it was. Joe, I've You're never like, even seen that. There's like a movie you brought Dump up Dump Truck earlier. Diaries. You guys don't watch that every night? <laughs> okay, well, I'm sorry. Look, I know I bring up weird things, but Heavy Metal Parking Lot's like a cultural thing. It's a documentary that's like, it's like 25 minutes long that these guys made where they just drive through and talk to people at a Judas Priest concert in like 1986 in the parking lot in Maryland. It's like a it's like a cultural landmark thing where like it's always reference to talk about. When you see it, you'll probably understand a bunch of jokes and references because it's like referenced that much. It's not like a weird underground thing. It's like pretty well known. I'll try to check it out. 